Okay, what is it with malware sites and their obsession with promising leaked footage or images of Rihanna topless, naked in some way, fucking Drake, fucking Chris Brown, fucking Bobby Lee, whoever. What's up with that bullshit? First off, it's always her. Whenever I'm browsing the internet or browsing Facebook by newsfeed, it's always Rihanna. That's the one person they always promise. Not any female that is really prone to showing any leaked sex tapes or images. Although she had, did have a couple of leaked nudes this year, the year before, three years ago, and five years ago. But nobody fucks with them. Nobody really cares. Where's the demand coming from? Most people look at these images, and even the least knowledgeable person on the internet knows that this is probably a trick. They might not think it's malware, but it might be a screamer. It never is. It might have some kind of virus. It might be some kind of prank. It might just be there to waste your time. They might be worried that they'll get hacked, or that they'll just be infested with non-stop cookies. But the point is, nobody cares. It's pretty much everywhere. If a nude was released, you could just Google it. Google Images is your friend. Google Images always shows nudes, even if you don't want to see it. You could type lamp on Google Images, and you'll see a naked girl holding a lamp. You could type, I don't know, sound on Google Images, and you'll hear, you'll see a cartoonish symbol for sound, I don't know, a wave, a frequency, a swirl, next to a naked girl. So it's not really necessary. But now that she does have a nude leak, thanks to her Instagram, you can see all those tan lines. She deleted it, but it's everywhere on the internet. And knowing the nature of Google and the interwebs, she'll live with that for the rest of her life. Or if the internet ever goes down permanently. But since I doubt that's in the near future, I'm just going to say that she fucked up. But knowing what kind of smarmy, confrontational attention whore she is, I don't really think she minds either. Besides, there are rumors that she is going to work for Playboy. She has a photo shoot. Whatever is going on, nobody cares. But I'm pretty sure malware sites and malware stuff on the internet, files, things of that nature, they have loads of inspiration now trying to trick newcomers and people that should work more when it comes to internet interactions and becoming internet savvy. After all, the web can be a predatory environment and if you don't learn to adapt, you could be the next sucker. It applies for everything else in this world. If you don't know the game, doesn't matter because the game knows you.